Good morning. We took a day off because yesterday was just kind of off to a really, really slow start. We had camped out um, right in the city, so we had to pick up and go pretty early, which resulted in us taking naps later on in the day. And then, uh, you know, we we're feeling a little hungover, tired, whatever, so we just tried to get to a couple hot springs, tried to get to a couple places with baths and showers and stuff, and it just one thing after the other failed over and over again because it was just a bad day for research, so I just didn't bother filming any of it. But uh, some days you just need, like, a day off to just... Yeah, just relax and do, do homebody stuff. But today we are back to adventuring and uh, we camped out at a trailhead last night, had some delicious breakfast this morning, so, so good. And we're going to uh, check out this trailhead before we head off and see some more mountain stuff. So time to get the day started. <laughs> Driving through the canyons, it's so beautiful here. It's such a perfect day for it. And when you know, we roll up on this amazing little diner, have some milkshakes, and eye up some amazing, beautiful motorbikes. This is definitely the kind of place on this kind of day, on a Saturday, definitely want to be riding bikes.
peak. It's really windy up here, 40 mile an hour wind. It's also really cold. We're at about 12,000 feet. We're not even at the top of it. They won't let us all the way to the top because the van will blow right off the edge. <laughs> also, shorts were a terrible idea. Yeah, I just dumped this about knee high in the snow, so. Oh, my bruise, I'm cut up, this is great. So they won't let us all the way to the top of the mountain, which means we can't get to have those like high altitude donuts that they make up there in the highest deep fryer in the world, I think. So uh, instead we're gonna have pho at almost the top of the mountain. And uh, yeah, that's still kind of cool and also very delicious. They have pho seasoning in a jar. Once I found that, it became like a steady staple of lunches in the van. So good. So that's somewhere between a pho and a ramen with chicken and pork sausages. So not very traditional, but very amazing. Enjoying his ramen. His battery's going battle scars. It's slippery out there, be careful. <laughs> it's things I do for YouTube. So I don't know if it's been obvious, but so far, <laughs> the whole time that this guy has been traveling with me, we've been having local amazing beers. And uh, I found this one just the other day. I thought it was very fitting, single track rye pale ale from Boulder, Colorado. I haven't tried it yet. So we're drinking beers at 12,000 feet. So it's super, super like fizzy, yeah. airy. Yeah, it's good. Does it mean the effects are more prolonged or something? Uh, yeah. Cheers. Cheers, buddy. This, seem a little nervous. This is the. This is probably going to be one of my hardest drives yet. Going down, what, five, six thousand feet? I don't know. I mean, pretty far. Yeah. So first gear all the way. Try not to burn the brakes completely out. I did just replace them, so we'll see. <laughs> I'm so nervous. <laughs> I feel like Floki from uh, Vikings. What the fuck is wrong with this? <laughs> it's fucking rude! <laughs> oh, wind. It's blowing against us to slow us down a bit. Nothing major, but... So a little impromptu stop here. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like this intersection is not so great for cars uh, getting through it. <laughs> not sure what's going on with this one over here. We're jump starting this one. And I think she's out of gas. <laughs> So you got the uh, Jeep running? Yep. <laughs> I got 
I got the Chevelle running. Yeah, you got the better one, I guess. Yeah, I, 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 did, I totally did. <laughs> but the Chevelle, all it was is um, sometimes on these like older V8s, the, the carburetor, when you come off the highway, especially like a highway where you're doing way faster than you were ever designed really to go, like normally, and then you just drop the, the gas like all at once, it shuts down the, the butterflies, but like it's still a bunch of fuel is getting in and it'll just like flood the engine or flood the intake and just like stall the engine. And then you go to start it and you do your regular kickover thing, but it's already full of gas and it just, you couldn't get it started because it was flooded. Mine was a little bit easier to explain. Uh... She didn't put gas in it. Oh, right. Very <laughs> you can't simple. put gas in a car. <laughs> I feel like I have so much energy when I'm not at 12,000 feet. Yeah. 4,000 feet just puts a little spring in your step. <sighs> Welcome to Garden of the Gods. Don't know anything about this park? Apparently it's real beautiful, so let's go check it out. Welcome to Manitou Springs. We're gonna check out some of the sites here tonight and uh, check out some of this. It's like a really cool old fashioned kind of town. It's really pretty.
you're so good last night. Oh! Oh! Get that. No! Oh! Yeah, nice shot. Ooh! No way! Yes! The present cycle is extremely active for all lion subjects. Business, health, and love will be good and improve as if first signs of the coming spring were felt already. The word conquest inspires Leo, women as well as men. Small business ventures will be extremely profitable. Health conditions are no more a problem. Sentimental interests are increasing and attraction are more and more active. Ooh. What'd you get? <laughs> Not 400. You did really <laughs> well. Are you are you freaking happy or what? I'm so happy right now. <laughs> you guys gotta check this place out. If you're ever in the area, definitely check it out. And don't play against me because I'll lose everything. <laughs> Time the clouds cover up that clear blue sky. And the tears cry for that woman who's gonna flood you the big river. I'm gonna sit right here until I die. Well, I met her accidentally in St. Paul, Minnesota. It told me up every time I heard her draw, Southern draw. Well, I heard the dream was back downstream, the board named Babin Ford. And I followed you big river away from call. Well, time to keep me mellow as a cry. <laughs> As we die. <laughs>